it is finally done. I have finally finished this football stadium. I am so happy. You interrupted my Netflix. Liz. Hmm. I finished it. Finished what? My football stadium. Are you proud of me? Yeah. No, you're not. So, before we kick things off, let's see if we can hit 100 likes this episode. I know it's a big goal, but I know we can do it. So, go ahead, hit that like button, show that love and support, and subscribe if you guys feel ever so kind. Down in the description will be a link to the world. And if you guys want to see the stadium before we get any further, and want to see what it looked like before we got this far, Go ahead and click the the button, the click, whatever you call them, the but yeah, you know what I mean. I forget what they're called, but anyway, click the button in the upper right hand corner if you want to see the full playlist. And there is going to be an announcement at the end of the video, so stay tuned for that. So let's get right on to the tour. Follow me on Twitter. Here we go. Uh, so that's my statue. I made this little spawn right here. Pretty proud of it. Um, I'm hoping you guys won't hear the sound of my headset uh, going do 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 do. I'm hoping that doesn't happen, but uh, been having some headset issues. But here is the uh, the opening gate. I think this looks a lot better. Let me actually turn down the sounds for the villagers uh, because they're gonna be a little bit loud. Uh, where would they be? Voice speech? No, no. Friendly creatures probably. Okay. Yeah, that was it. So this is the uh, like the bag check and then the tickets over there. Uh, and I actually have boundary blocks around them so they can't go anywhere. So we go right through here. Thank you very much. Um, and let's begin with the tour. So, uh, this is the arcade right here. I did my best with, uh, some of these things. We got some, uh, this is supposed to be like a skill crane type deal. Uh, these are just, you know, your regular arcade games. And then we got the same over here, a TV for the game. And then we go out into the field over there, but we're not going to go there just yet. Uh, let's see what else we got. We'll fly over here. We got the ramp, but we'll go up there a bit later because we don't want to see the field just yet. Uh, nothing around here. Uh, another ticket entrance over there and some seating areas right here. Uh, over here, we got a concession stand. Uh, we got the bathrooms over here. This is the, uh, the Ender ladies over here. And then we got the Endermen over here. So, we go over here, uh, not gonna look in there. This is my attempt at a jungle gym, right here. Uh, definitely did a horrible job here, but that's okay. Uh, so this is the, uh, the jungle gym. Endy's Jungle Gym, that's the name of our mascot. That's the name, uh, I decided to go with. Someone actually commented that, and I was thinking the exact same thing. So basically, you go up here, uh, there's a ladder here, and then... Uh, this was, I was going to do a slide, but it took up way too much room, so I just did whatever the hell you want to call that thing. Um, and then uh, basically the same thing over here, tickets. Uh, no bag check, though, but we got tickets. And then um, more seating over here. And then we got some fountains out there because I had to figure uh, something out to put over here. I uh, got the tickets right here, and I love how all the villagers stare at this one guy. It's really funny. So we got the ticket office there. Um, I think that's about it. We'll look at the uh, the restaurant right here as well. Uh, right here. There's a lot of restaurants. Uh, there's one, two, two restaurants, I think. Yeah, two restaurants. In the, wait, yeah, two. Uh, actually, we'll go here next because you can see the field. Um... Right here, we have uh, a water ice stand. And then over here, we have uh, food and drinks. And then we have our, uh, whatever, you, what do you call it? Uh, <laughs> you're, you're like fan shop right here. So we got uh, the jerseys, home and away. Then we got our cashier. Uh, game used end zone turf and game used footballs. And then we got our models of the windows. Um, and then that's it for the first level. And we got a nice looking fountain up there. Don't want to show you guys the field quite yet though. But we'll get to it next. And then we'll go to the restaurant now right here. 
Pretty nice restaurant though. So right here we got a, the restaurant, which you can see the field from in here. Actually, let me turn the render distance up. Now that I got my beefy computer, we can turn it up a lot. Uh, so this is the uh, the restaurant. We got our bartender here. Uh, oh, that was from the teaser. I forgot about that. Um, or not the teaser. The uh, what do you call it? Uh, for TDM, I did a uh, announcement video, and I still left that there. I didn't know that was still there. That's funny though. Um, we got our bushes here. So we got a bar, a couple tables. I really like this uh, this restaurant here. It looks really cool once you get onto the field too. Hopefully it turns nighttime soon as well. Um, let's go to the second level now. Uh, I don't want to take this ramp though. I want to take the other one. But yeah, I apologize that this series took so long. And I know you guys, I know what's going to be coming up in the comments. You should do a hockey arena. Everyone wants me to do a hockey arena. I don't plan on doing one anytime soon though. Uh, I kind of want to take a break from creative, but um, here's another restaurant. But uh, not saying it might, uh, not saying that it's not going to happen in the future though. Got another restaurant here, a little bar here. Didn't put a bartender here though. I actually totally forgot to, but that's okay. Just kidding. There was one here the whole time. <laughs> Moving on with the tour. So we're gonna go back over here. We have another bartender. And then we got our scoreboard, a bar, and some uh, bar stools. This is our scoreboard. I'm actually really happy with how this came out. I was like, whoa, it would be awesome to make the uh, the Ender Dragon head, the scoreboard. And I was not expecting it to come out like this. It was just supposed to look basic. But I decided to make it a little bit different, and I really love how it came out. So uh, this is the field itself. Uh, we got our suites over there, which we will go look at. Uh, some concession stands, a tiki bar. And then uh, all around the stadium, we got some other things. And then, um, yeah, just some trees, some fountains. The end is, uh, which I think is funny because it's the end, the end, ender zone. Instead of end zone, it's the ender zone. <laughs> okay, moving on. We got fountains all around the first level, which I thought was a really cool fit. And I really like how uh, these look um, on the field, especially the uh, the restaurant here. I really love how that came out. Um we got our players. We got a play going on over here. We got the ref. Uh, who's going to make that catch? Who knows? There's our mascot, Endy. It's nighttime, too, which is awesome. Love how the field looks at night. Got our team, the away team. Got the home team. Uh, and then we got our tunnels. Let's go and look at the locker room over here. Uh, here's our coach's office. Doors open because I was in here uh, earlier putting stuff in here. This is just some extra stuff uh, that I was using. Um... Got our, you know, just some plants, some pictures. Really like how this uh, room ended up looking. Uh, let me turn the, uh, the point of view uh, down or up a little bit. Uh, we got uh, just a little lounge area here. This was supposed to be a TV, like a corner TV, but uh, or a TV in the corner, I should say. Didn't end up looking that great, but you know what? It works. Um, down here, we got the actual locker room. Uh, just this is actually where the shout out stuff was gonna be at first um, But then I decided to make an actual wall like I did for the baseball stadium So I think that looks a lot better and I think it yeah fit a lot more people as well, so we'll get there eventually uh, Let's go do 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 that's for last that's for the surprise at the end um, and Then because I got a package and I'm not sure what it is, but uh, we'll open it together but, um, and then over here, we have to go in this way. Shout out walls over there, by the way. Um, let me, I just want to make sure I'm covering everything. Uh, we got the suites down here. Uh, they're pretty much all the same, just things are in different places. Uh, there's not really a special suite, but, uh, very good seats, definitely. Uh, basically, everyone has a TV, a bar, and a little couch or seating area. Uh, so I'll just show you guys. I'm not sure where that water. I think it's the fountain below me, but I'm not sure where that water's coming from. I think there's like flowing water, but like I know there's flowing water, but I think there's a weird spot because I remember looking at it earlier. Uh, so basically, they all look the same. I'll just give you a little uh, brief run through what they look like. So I think they look. They came out uh, pretty well, and then these steps just lead down there as well. So yeah, that's the uh, the suites, and then we got some concession stands. We got the tiki bar here. Oh, we forgot another villager. Whatever will we do? There's Carl. 
All right. And then we got, uh, the, yeah, Tiki Bar got some tables. Uh, this was a cool idea I think I had. At first it was just supposed to be like a, you know, standing room only area. But I like uh, the Tiki Bar. I thought I had more than one rest, like more than two restaurants. I thought I had like eight because <laughs> I feel like there was a restaurant in every episode I made. Uh, this is supposed to be candy. Don't ask me. I try to improvise. We forgot some. Problem solved. <laughs> I can't believe I forgot to put candy there. I thought I got all the way around. I'm not sure how I missed that. Oh, well. But, yeah. Uh, so, we got candy here. And then these lead up to the, uh, the third level. So, we'll go there eventually. Uh, another concession stand here. And then uh, this is water ice over here. And then we got the ramp there, which just leads all the way down to the bottom. I don't like this ramp as much as the other one, but um, some people thought the other one looked better. But, I mean, someone was like, it doesn't really matter. It's just the ramps, which I agree. This is just game use memorabilia. We got our concession guy there. We got a uh, starting lineup card, game use turf, end zone turf, game use football, game use uniform. And then uh, just some stuff on the sides to sell as well um another entry to the uh third level and let me move my mic back a little bit uh these are just drinks right here refreshments refreshments uh apparently that's what they're called now we'll have to fix that that's okay though we'll live with it um and then over here we got food don't worry all this stuff or barbecue my bad all the stuff I missed, don't worry, is going to be edited uh, for the final, uh, what do you call it, the final world. Um, and I believe that's it. I'll just show you guys. I'll go up this way to the uh, upper level. I think the stadium ended up looking great. Obviously, not every seat is going to be perfect, but uh, that would just be way too difficult to, uh, to, you know, try and calculate. But um, I really am happy with how this go this uh, looks. And I'll show you guys this real quick uh, since I was able to figure this out. I didn't even know this was an option, so I think it's something new. But uh, you can do set time night. Or time set day. Shit. Uh, set time day. Did I do it? I don't think I did it right. No, it's time set day. Come on, Finn. There we go. And then the lights, well, I think that's why it lagged. Yep, there we go. The lights do go off, and then we'll set it back at night just because I like how it looks at night. Time set night. There we go. And then the lights will turn back on. So I don't think it was always like that because I think the daylight or the uh, yeah the daylight sensors used to only be like that. But I'm glad that they're like this now. I think it looks cool. But yeah, I'm really happy with how this stadium came out all together. A uh, few things I forgot to get to, though, like the uh, the candy over there, and then a couple con uh, concession stands that didn't have vendors, but um, still, I'm glad with how it went. And if you guys are wondering how uh, the field itself is actually lit, there's a carpet underneath, uh, or there's lights underneath uh, some of the carpet, but it's kind of hard to tell when you're up from above, so that's why it's like that. And then... um. We'll do that last. I'm trying to think what else there is to do. I'll show you guys the outside of the stadium, too. Uh, we'll do the shout-out wall now. Uh, we can get rid of this. I don't need that anymore. And I don't need my shit-to-do list anymore. This was, like, my checklist right here. Uh, so let's start with the shout-out wall. We have at GamerBoyPlays. By the way, all these people are on Twitter. At uh, BrettRocks12. Compatre. I think that's how you say your name, bud play on Highlands with him. We got PZ Pink WL, someone on Pixel that I play with. Really awesome gal. Uh, Canadian Ice, Sherry Dactyl, Dead Wilson, also another member of Pixel, as well as Dead Wilson. Uh, YouTube, also play TDM with him. Megan Does Art, another Pixel member. Hun Hunty Buckets, Cranberry, Matt Terp Slacks 17. I'm, I'm probably really slaughtering these names. Stigman 13. He had his own game show that I was a part of, but had to delete the recordings for TDM. So Stigman 13. 
the Taha one member of Galaxy SMP when I used to play on there. Uh, I'm probably going to murder this. Videra Garvit. I hope I said that right. Alexis, or no, Alex is Tapia, or is it Alexis Tapia? It's probably Alexis Tapia. 3231. That was really bad. I'm sorry. Uh, at Exiac, and at I don't know Jeb, another member of Pixel. Oh, wait, no. Exiac is now, or Exiac is now on Pixel. I totally forgot. I'm sorry, X. Uh, so this is a shout out wall. I'm sorry if I uh, slaughtered any of your names. I'm really sorry. But um, this is the shout out wall. And then uh, got some little ender work here. And uh, why isn't this lighting up? What the hell? There we go. Fixed it. And then I think that's pretty much it. I think there's, I feel like there's something else I did not cover. I really feel like there is. Uh, I gotta think. Let me show you guys around the stadium as well. Um, so this is what it looks like from the back. I really like this. This is my favorite part of the stadium. I was actually wondering, what should I do for a thumbnail? Should I do like right here or should, or should I do the inside of the stadium? I think the inside would look better though. Uh, like right here or on an angle obviously. And then, yeah, we did the concession or the uh, merchandise stand. It actually looks a lot better with the trees and stuff. I really like how it looks with that. Uh, it's no longer like bland. And then, um, so much better than the baseball stadium. So much better. The baseball stadium was pretty bad. It, it finished really bad. I love how this looks, too. Uh, the jungle gym. But that is pretty much it. Oh, yeah, and I did the, uh, the windows here. I think the windows look cool, uh, how they came out, uh, with the, uh, the Eye of Ender. But, um... I think that's pretty much it. So let's go to the teaser. We'll take one of the tunnels just so I can show you guys how that looks. Nothing too spectacular. But um, there also is a sign that my girlfriend placed when she was on my computer. Uh, I don't quite remember where it is. I think it's over there by the ticket office. If you guys, uh, you have to destroy blocks to get to it though. But there's a little Easter egg. So let's see what there is. Cause I know, let me clear my inventory too. Uh, I could just do slash clear. I think that's what it is. I don't know. Too late now. Alright, bye Carl. Alright, let me see what this is. Order S2 UMC. Let's see what this is. Okay. Your package has been delivered and handled with great care. Dark Flame wasn't very happy about us giving... Ha or ha about us having to take it and claims he will get it back. Best of luck. My next. Oh god, my next delivered it. What is it? Let's see. Let's see what's in here. Hello? I don't remember putting all this stuff in here, though. It's like a lot of supplies. Iron gates. Huh. A lot of chests, though. This looks like a boundary of some sort. I know this is the away locker room. I don't know what they did with it, though, while the game was going on. I don't know how they were able to do this. Let's see what's let's see what's behind here. Let's get rid of the corners first. I'm not sure. Dark flame. Why wouldn't he be happy about it? Oh no. Oh no. It's his armor from UMC season Oh no. Oh, it's season two of UMC. We're doing a season two, it looks like, and it's gonna take place here. Oh, now I remember, of course. So UMC season two is going to take place here, and it's going to be a little bit differently. What I will tell you guys is that instead of it being uh, just in the map, there's gonna be some challenges that will take place throughout the entire stadium. That's right, and also, it's going to be teams as well. So I'm really looking forward to it. It's going to be a lot of fun, and um, I hope it goes well. And I think I hope it's better than last season because um, I think it will be. I think it's going to be a much better arena. I I already have an an idea for next season or season three too, but uh, let's worry about the second one. Not sure when it's going to be announced, so. Um, or when it's going to actually happen. But um, 
hopefully sometime this summer. Probably later on, though, because I have a lot of Let's Plays I'm doing at the moment. But, um, that's pretty much the entire stadium. I think I covered everything within a very short amount of time, surprisingly. But, um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it. I don't think there's anything else. I did make a little checklist, but no, I got everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And the world download will be in the description down below. And as always, I will see you guys in the next episode. And thank you guys so much for another successful Minecraft creative series. Peace!